right, coming up next, a UFC featherweight division fight. I'm excited for this one. This is a kickboxer of the highest order. He has so many different kicks and punches in his arsenal and figures to try to keep this on the feet here tonight. The beautiful thing that he does is he throws that front push kick to create distance when a guy starts to get too close and wants to wrestle with him. He throws it, and the moment you're back at his range, he starts to blast high kick. He doesn't always intend on landing him, but he beats up your arm with high kick after high kick after high kick. And as you get desperate, you start to run into knees, and he does not need much space to land a knockout punch. This guy is one of the best strikers we've ever seen in the UFC. And if you don't find the striking range early against this guy, you could be in real trouble. Well, you can argue this is the most influential martial artist of all time, the great Bruce Lee, making his walk to the octagon here tonight, champ. Everybody wants to be Bruce Lee. They say they want to be like Mike. If you're a fighter, you want it to be like Bruce Lee. You want it to be that fast. You want it to be that charismatic. You want it to have an ability to just freeze your opponents. Your speed, your movement, just the diversity in the attacks that you can give your opponents would just confuse people. I mean, I watched him beat a seven-foot Kareem after Jabbar to stay undefeated. Right. If you can do that, you can do anything. I fear not the man who has practiced 10,000 kicks once, but I fear the man who has practiced one kick 10,000 times, Bruce Lee, in a nutshell. Just so wise. Our tale of the tape for this featherweight fight. Two years apart, these two fighters, and they both possess a similar height and reach. And now, for the Ladies official introductions, we go inside the octagon where we find the venerable Bruce Lee. When the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Eve LeBain. This is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC featherweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet, eight inches tall, weighing in at 137 pounds. Fighting out of Bridgewater, Massachusetts, USA, Golden. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the right corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet, seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting out of Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon Lee. Okay, guys, protect yourself at all time, obey my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now, go back to your corner. gets underway and it'll be interesting to see how this matchup plays out definite striker on one side against another guy who can really do it all and in those situations normally the guy that's more well-rounded will be the one that will find success i want to see how this plays out opens with the left hand and lands flush big powerful punch lands now he gets back to range Going back to his patented kicks here, but unable to find the target there. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Well, one got through, that kick was blocked. Connects there with a punch, so pretty good striking display by him thus far. He throws everything so straight and so accurate. Switch the guard, lands the right hand. Just a slip there. I mean, look at the commitment to kicking in this fight. All right, he'll engage in a 
single collar tie. Oh, wow! Head kick! Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. What a body kick. The right hook to the body. Some fighters shy away from checking a leg kick. Check that one. That's a big strike right there. Swing and a miss with that straight left hand. Then he comes through with a big knee. Another huge knee. Lands flush with that right hand. You can really limit the mobility of your opponent with those leg kicks. Well, that kick landed the body beautifully placed right underneath that elbow. Let's see if he makes the adjustments now defensively to avoid opening up that midsection to further damage by that kick. Oh, connects with the one-two. Misses again with a right punch. Nice straight punch. Look at the turtle in that kick. And both guys really throwing with authority. There's... Oh. Take a head kick like this. That is such toughness to even be on his feet right now. Nice head movement to slip the left hand. And continues with the inside leg kick. He just misses there with the left. Oh, and he lands another leg kick there. I have a novel idea. Maybe the opponent should try to check one of these. He's got to try to check him, but he can't, John, because there's no wind-up. Yeah. There's no tell. And when he feels his opponent is getting a beat on his leg kick, he'll just pop a jab up, get the hands up to block the face, blast the leg kick on the bottom. It's unbelievable to watch a guy that is so diverse yeah. and has such a great understanding of landing these leg kicks. Lambs the knee to the body now. Lee gets caught with that punch. 30 seconds now to go in the round. Oh, look at that jab. Snapped his head back. His jab gets to the target so fast, it always brings his hands right back to his face. Oh, man. Looks to be hit with one of those knees to the body. What a takedown. Oh, and this might just be a matter of Oh, and there's the horn at the end of the round. How about this fight, folks? You see, he was nearly caught in a submission there right at the end of the round. Saved by the bell. So back to the stool. Mentally probably not in a great place here. We'll see if he can recover and get himself back into this fight. All right, let's check out some of the action now from that previous round. And he really kept finding a home for those kicks. Yeah, and why would you change it? If your opponent is not going to check, if he's going to stand there, and he's not on his toes, and he's stationary. You keep driving those kicks into his thighs, into his body, until he makes some sort of adjustment. Ready? All right, second round underway. I mean, he's cutting them down to size with these beautiful leg kicks, beautiful punch. Kick to the body here. That one appeared to be blocked. There's no give on that leg kick. Caught that kick there. And they separate. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Watch knees to the body. Whoa! 
to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish his fight. Lee gets caught with that punch. Got to shore up the defense here. Caught the kick. Big knee to the body. Liver kick. If you take those kicks, it's going to shut your body off. Just misses with that one. And he landed the right hand there. Look at the torso on the right side. Major bruising, and it's only getting worse. Just out of range with that left hook. Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. Oh, nice connection there with the punch, DC. Great timing to land that punch. Oh, he heard it badly, the jab. Back and forth we go! A perfect combination. Slip that offering from his opponent. In the past, we've seen him sort of lean on the toughness. Tonight, he's leaning on the defense. And you see the evolution of the fighter in front of us. He doesn't have to be tough anymore. The more he can slip it right, the longer he can prolong his career. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Missed with that right hand. Well, he was a little bit lackluster in round one. You can't say the same here in this second round. He has really picked up the pace, an uptick in the aggression and the output, and starting to find his range here in the pocket. And he lands a punch there. Pretty good connection by him. Great connection. He's in a great flow right now. to the well with that right hand, it's no good. All right, so he's landed some good shots tonight, but this is not a combo here, right? No three-piece, no soda. It's one and done more often than not. John, don't you come to me without a combo. I want the whole platter. <laughs> Give him the whole platter, young man. Put some punches together. Make this guy take the whole thing. Give him more than one strike. You have now found a set of punch. The jab is landing consistently. Find something that's going to go behind it. Just out of the range with that right hand. Oh, huge block! Oh, pinpoint knee to the body. If you're trying to knock me out, you get one knee to the body, I'm done. Every time the opponent tries to get close, he just drives that knee to the body. Great time. Nice. and forth we go here. Ground and pound strikes continue to rain down. The opponent better move out of harm's way or the referee's gonna stop this. Thing. He better start to move, and when his opponent starts to posture, he needs to put his feet on the hip, push him away to try to escape this very, very dangerous condition. Well, he continues to find the openings tonight. Beautiful connection with the punch there. Accuracy at its best. All right, no telestrator for the champ tonight, but that's okay. He'll still talk you through the replays. Body kicks for days, man. I mean, body kicks for days, but I got to be honest, John. If we don't incorporate a telestrator <laughs> into this game, this may be my only version of EA UFC. All right, so after he landed a high number of kicks in the previous round, we'll see if he can keep it going here as our next round gets under. He should stay the course. He's so educated with his legs and his feet that he's given his opponent a very difficult time trying to anticipate what's coming his way.
nice good punch land. on that offering. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection, and these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Great punch. Big head kick. How good that feels to get kicked like that. John, it doesn't. <laughs> it doesn't feel good to get kicked like that. Oh, it looked like that left hand found the target. Found the target as it has in so many cases tonight. Punches in bunches, and he hasn't really shown any signs of slowing down here tonight. I'm not sure how much more his opponent can take. Effective punch there by Lee. Oh, he's wearing it now, bleeding from his cheek. Oh, nice. Nice. Three minutes now to go in this one. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Right hand upstairs. Gotta admire the urgency here. He is trying to keep the judges out of it. Lighten up his opponent left and right. just can't feel good. Look at the size of that bruise on his body, and you gotta think his opponent is gonna continue to attack that area. Nice punch there. Lee's hook shot is blocked. Saw that coming from a mile away. of those types of strikes. All right, he engages in a single collar tie here. Boy, tie club. Ooh, what a punch. Oh, he got that inside leg kick to the target there, DC. You don't want to eat too many of those. No, you can't. It starts to beat up the inside thigh. That is a technique you use to really slow down your opponent. Oh, he has landed a high volume of strikes in this round and really hasn't let up when it comes to his aggressiveness. The striking has been on point every step of the way. Careful to not gas out, but you gotta like the output here down the stretch. Lee's kick, that one blocked. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. There you go. Oh, he continues to attack that bloody cheek. His face is a mess. Pretty good work with the strikes here off of his back by Lee. All right, now we'll get you some highlights, DC, from that previous round. You know he's got a penchant for landing those head kicks and certainly found that form in that previous round. Very rarely 
do you get a fight where a guy gets kicked in the head this many times? He better make some adjustments. He better keep his hands up, or he's going to go good night very soon. Back out here, work on that cut. Deep breath and relax. There's a lot of blood. He cut you open good. All right, here we go as our next round gets underway. His strong leg packs so much power that even when he doesn't throw the full throttle, you see he's able to inflict damage. We'll see if he can keep it going here. He doesn't throw it full power, but even when he fakes it, he draws out reactions from his opponents because they don't want to get hit with any more of those kicks. It's a sight to behold. Very nice outside leg kick by him there, DC. We'll see if he follows it up here. He's really driving his shin into his opponent's thigh, beating his leg up. Oh, he lands another strike to the body. He just continues to punish his opponent's midsection here in this round. Big kick land. Wow. Oh, that's a good right hand. Massive head kick. Oh! Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Man, striking class is in session. Beautiful punch there. Great job landing. What a damaging punch. Out of range with that kick attempt. Oh! Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Now goes in and secures the takedown. All right, has the guard closed here. Well, pretty good work off of the bottom here by Lee. Back to the feet now. He continues to land a high number of strikes here, just like he did in the previous round. This is a world-class display of striking here tonight. You got to check these low leg kicks. Oh! Oh! It's right there. The seventh blow of the fight. And it was perfect. It was absolutely perfect, John. Great placement on that uppercut. Oh! He's in trouble. She's hurt bad. Great punch landed with so much power. Well, the left hook has been there at times, not that time. Oh! Great shot, great shot. Keep the pressure. Nice straight right lance. They continue to exchange. That thing is leaking bad now. Straight punch land. Well, eventually you know he's going to turn this defense into offense, but he's certainly doing a nice job on the defensive end thus far. They talk about the feeling out process. He's getting his opponent's timing. Now he's blocking everything. Expect counters as we go forward. Over and over, he's landing these big body kicks. He has a commitment to kicking tonight, and it shows. Oh! He was hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Big punch land through the middle. He's giving him so many different things right now. Under a minute now to go on the round. Attacking the body now. That shot blocked. Single collar tie. Big leg kick land. Went for the inside leg kick. Whoa! Oh, big dive and punch to the head. He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Well, anytime you are in a ground fighting situation with this fighter, you're potentially playing with fire. 
right side control now. Well, you've got to be working off of your back. He's certainly doing so here. Nice punch. Come able on. to land the single no, ground something. strike there. Strong bottom work here, staying busy. All right, so he gets knocked down, but not out. Let's look back at some of the highlights, DC. A huge round on the other side. He had him hurt very bad. He found the shot. He got exactly what he wanted. When he saw the opening, he jumped on it, and he hurt his opponent very bad. If he can get back to that one more time, he may end the night. Fifth and final round, fourth cover. Big cut lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one? Man, that cut is only getting worse. Canvas cleanup guy's gonna be busy. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Him with a head kick that at least partially landed. Oh my goodness! Oh, what a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish this fight. Oh! Whoa! Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Big punch land. Knee to the body. Oh, he's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Back to the feet. Whoa! Dude's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Able to check that kick as well. Three minutes now to go to decide this one. Back to the feet. Now a knee to the body. Under three minutes now to go round five. Checks the leg kick. Nice loop at once. Single collar tie now. Lee gets caught by the straight punch. Oh, he lands another shot to the head. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Wow! And just like that, the fight is over. He got him! What a fight! I'm not sure if that's the way he drew it up, but a huge result for him here tonight as he gets the win by way of knockout. And that's about as good a one-strike finish as we've seen here in the UFC in recent memory. I'm not even sure the opponent saw it coming. So a big, big win for him here tonight. Well, he's going to enjoy watching this one back. Let's take a look at the replay of the knockout just a moment ago. It was right hand after right hand after right hand. Finally, he found the one that hit the exact sweet spot that ended his opponent's night. So a strong candidate for some bonus money there. A huge knockout for him here tonight. Near perfect execution. They'll be talking about this result for some time. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Ian Levine's called a stop to this contest at two minutes, 37 seconds of round number five. We're going to win her by knockout, Golden! Well, there will be no shutting that smile off tonight. The celebration is on as he gets a huge win by knockout tonight. I gotta think there are a few better feelings in the world than walking into an octagon and candidly knocking another man out. Yeah, you shut a person's lights off, man. There's nothing like it. Now, I understand a lot of times we hope